Okay. Who's back of the week? Hank. Hank and I have a beef, but we're he's good with me. I'm apologize to you. I was back to Tiger Woods. Oh wow. He's on a golf right, club. So it is deep. People went crazy. Mm-hmm. Is it people think this is a fucking easy game. This this game of ours. This life of ours. I mean, you're it's on a not. mushing clinic. Again. You made a side bet. Against our If I looked in your account, bet. you made side bets too. No, I bet the Steelers. I said I bet the Steelers. I think what, it's what also a, a big Harris? part of it is that you were you were celebrating. I had Najee audibly. Harris. You didn't tell us about that. I, didn't I know said about it that. out loud. I said I have Najee Harris to score a touchdown. The Steelers. The I didn't. Steelers, I remember Steelers. hearing that. It was all Steelers. It was all correlated Steelers. There was nothing Chargers. I said betting the Steelers. So it's like you're apologizing, but you're also not taking any blame. It's confusing. I'm just confused. Which which one is it? Tell me. I'll take ten percent blame for the mush, but I think the mush, like the the idea that I mushed it, it was already a mean friendship thing to do. So it's like it doesn't it doesn't fall under the regular rules of gambling etiquette when you already broke the gambling etiquette. You made it a war. You made it a you made there was no what's the rules of engagement. There's there's usually a, an understanding that going into these games, Hank always sends out a parlay plus for the boys. For the boys. And I, I didn't see a parlay plus for the boys come across the boys chat. And it was, if it had not been discussed that we were all betting the Steelers, which I remember vividly, PFT said, what are we betting? I said, I think we should take the Steelers. If that had not been discussed, then I wouldn't have given a fuck. But we said we're all taking the Steelers, and then you had a bet that was the Chargers. You were also, you were kind of starting to high step on us. A little bit. I stepped in a little bit. So then don't say sorry. You're Taunting. clearly not sorry. No, I said I'm 10% sorry. Okay. Do you accept my 10%? 10%, sorry? I accept it. Okay. I think Do that's you, fair. Okay. All right, good. Then we're good. I think that's fair. The amount that I'm sorry you've accepted. Mm hmm. So we're good. Yep. Yeah. So, so in a way, he accepted 100% yeah, of correct. your 10%. Yes, yeah, correct. Yes, yeah, correct. Because that was all I had. All right. Bygones nope. be bygones. Yeah, bygones be bygones. Yeah. All right, what's your who's back? Tiger Woods. <laughs> Swung a golf club. I've won one crazy. What kind of golf club was it? I don't know, but I will be swinging a golf club on Wednesday, and I expect that same reaction. Hell yeah! Hank's Sweet. Back. Uh, are golf courses still open? Yeah. Oh, do they close? Yeah, no, they close. They, right? Just weather can. I'm not a golfer. You, you can play. If yeah. Oh. I think it's like after Thanksgiving because it's like a, I mean it's like a tournament yeah, yeah, with yeah. friends from home and shit. It's not you really said like it, a Hank. serious event. It took Tiger what like nine months to be able to golf again. It's going to take you like three weeks. Who's tougher? Yeah. You Hank got this. Exactly. You got this. Back from major back surgery from his chiropractor. Love it. Major back readjustment. Yeah. All right. Uh, who's back of the week? PFT. Uh, I got a couple. Is that okay? Us Hank, Hank, you're, Hank's going to be editing. So. <laughs> yeah, you guys are – Keeping it tight, like you said. Okay. Uh, <laughs> my first who's back of the week is keeping your beers cold outside. I love this time of the year. Say this every week. <laughs> I don't think I've I, I don't think I've said this this year. Oh, what? I haven't said it this year. Go check the tape. All right. Here's check what I tape. will say right now. Yeah. All Cam says no. Liam says no. No. Here's what I'm gonna H say. Slashing out. Here. No. Here's what I'm gonna say though. All right. So <laughs> I only I only I'm gave so mad. I only gave Hank 10 percent of an apology. I I accept 100 percent of Hank's bad mood. I think that's totally fair. I think what I think you being mad right now is completely warranted, and I think it's completely appropriate. So I accept your lashing out, and I I I welcome it. I welcome your lash out. And it's and no one can judge. No one can judge Hank's lash out because that was a bad loss, and a bad who's back. And, oh, but isn't wow. that do you, just do you think that, do you accept what I just said as being a, a, a olive branch to our friendship coming back? <coughs> sure. Do you don't think so? All no, right, because, fine. Forget cause, it. Because now Hank has redirected his anger at me. He's fine with you now. Well, we did figure out the ten percent deal. He's just which passing it. Okay. Um, Keeping your beers cold outside because it's God's refrigerator and it's winter time and the mountains turn blue outside now. Do shorts next. You can just put them outside in the snow. Do shorts. You don't have to worry about putting them in the fridge. Just leave your beer outside. They Love get it. cold. Love it. Love That's it. a good Great one. Great who's back of the week, right? Sure. Mm -hmm. Everyone. My other who's back of the week is Miley shorts. Cyrus. <laughs> my other who's back. My next who's back of the week is making JFK jokes. <laughs> my other who's back of the week is making Hitler jokes. My next who's back of the week is making fun of Hank's ass. 
Oh. My other who's back of the week is uh, oh Ed Sheeran had a thing where he said that yeah he doesn't pee at urinals because people take little peeks as little mm. tiny wee wee but we all know it's because he can't pee at a urinal. Have I told that story before? Yeah, yeah, it's okay. I love it every time. Uh, my other who's back of the week is reading. Yeah, the reading's back. As Hank alluded to, he's been editing together the Goodell versus Obama book that I wrote in 2014. We've turned it into an audio book. Maybe. And if Hank doesn't delete <laughs> the entire file, <laughs> it'll be coming out on Cyber Month. No, it's Black Friday, right? Yeah. <laughs> no, no. Actually, though, there's uh, there's which a, year? 2023. Yeah, there's a sele- There's a very small number of actual physical copies that we're selling, and I think once those sell out, we'll put out the audiobook. Got we'll it. Put out the audiobook. But the if audi- you want a hard copy, make sure you're on top of your shit Black Friday because those will go fast. Audiobook's going to be great. It features a lot of people at Barstool doing the different voices. It's got Big Cat on there. It's got Hank on there. It's got Billy. It's got Jake. It's got Frank the Tank. It's got Brandon Walker, Nick Tarani, Roan. A lot of people fights. A lot of people contribute voices to it. And it's going to be very funny. I heard the rough cut. And it's awesome, so be on the lookout for that. It's coming out as soon as the actual books sell out, which will be on sale, I believe, on Black Friday. So, And we just discovered New York Times has a bestseller list for audiobooks. I just kind of want to call myself a New York Times bestselling author. There so we go. The audiobook, audiobook version. Audiobook it. Love it. Um, all right. My Who's Back is Feast Week, best gambling week of the year. Hank, you want to do some gambling this week as a team? Sure. Okay. College basketball every day, football every night. I love it. I love it. That's I love how it. that's how I'll make money. College basketball. Start taking your picks. Oh, I'm sorry. <laughs> I'm sorry. Did this did the Steelers cover? They did. That they did. But your parlay plus, that would have Oh no, because you had the Chargers. You're right, yeah. That, yeah. I'm I was wrong. You were right. I listen, I'm not looking for a congratulations. I'm a terrible, terrible gambler. I lose all the time uh everyone knows that i mean it's kind of what I, it's kind of my brand if anyone thought that like not sharing gambling picks and and mushing people was going to be the end of part of my take mm. you pro- you were going to be right paying attention you, were, you haven't been paying attention <laughs> hank is as mad as i've seen him in a while right it's now. okay we're getting it out right it's now like a little hornet this is like when you have a fight at, at like you go you go to like a, a dinner with a bunch of different couples it's like you, and you wrongly think that if you just air the fight out in a joking way in front of everyone, mm-hmm. you won't have the fight back at home. It just makes oh, you still have the fight back, at and home. it makes it weirder way for everybody worse. around yeah, you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So the, you, you, the listener, right now, you're the other couples. And once the microphones are off, we'll have the real fight. And it's gonna get ugly. <laughs> the look Hank's giving Billy right now for that that noise he made. Now he's now, now he's redirected. No, I'm, la- I'm, no, no, I'm laughing at him because he's being like Colin Coward. No, that's but that's oh, Billy, wow. you, when you grow oh, up wow. you'll find you'll you'll find what I just said is very true. Hank when you grow like up. he wanted to kill. Why Billy. are you angry at me? I don't know. Made a weird noise. Like, no, I'm fine. All right, I'm not Billy, mad go at ahead. all. Let's wrap this show up before it <laughs> Dude, all falls who's, apart. Who's